All right, here's a new toy I got in the mail. Um, I hadn't seen one of these before. I don't know why. Maybe I haven't been looking. But it's an LED display for an Arduino. Um, or whatever. It's I squared C input, so um, it only takes two pins to drive this thing. Uh, there is a five pin connector on the back, but it's um, power, 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 ground, and uh, data and clock for the I squared C. So uh, it's pretty nice. Uh, I hadn't seen any, I've seen modules like this before, I squared C modules for uh, uh, seven segment displays or uh, other types of LCD displays and stuff, but I've never seen one for this weird, what's called a 14-segment a uh, LED. It has these uh, uh, cross members as well. Um, and so it can supposedly do alphanumeric. Um, the uh, part number of this thing is an HT16K33. Now, uh, HT16K33 is actually the part number for this chip on the back, uh, this uh, uh, Holtec Hol chip, and it's the I squared C to uh, LED driver, and it can drive a whole bunch of different things. Um, so um, the segment size is 0.54 inches, 14 segment LED. It defaults to a 70 hex. Uh, I squared C address, but you can jump it to other addresses. Um, and what else can I say about it? It's uh, it's pretty straightforward. So we'll go ahead and use our uh, use our Nano here, and I've gone ahead and wired it up. So I have a a, a, a couple wires in the back. I have uh, uh, power and ground, and then there's this extra pin that requires another power connection. It sets the logic level of the board. If it's 3.3, .3, you wire it to 3.3. .3. If it's 5, you wire it to 5. Everything here is 5, so I've wired it up for 5. And then you have the uh, I squared C data clock here. So that's that's all it that's all it takes. And uh, and then this should plug on top here. And uh, yeah. Uh, let me get some uh, let me get some power leads and we'll uh, get this thing going. All right, uh, here's the display, and uh, if I hit reset, it'll go through uh, a program. Now this program I downloaded from Adafruit, so Adafruit has drivers for this board. Uh, it's their Adafruit LED driver, and it supports all kinds of different things. And this is the four-digit alphanumeric, so when you load in the driver, you need to point to that. Um, but here we go. Uh, it's going to go through uh, character set. So one, two, three, four, five is good. Um, actually, the capital letters are okay. Uh, capital letters seem to be just fine. In fact, they're pretty good. And then it goes through uh, some characters, and it goes through lowercase. Now, the lowercase is sometimes okay and sometimes really bad. So uh, beware of that. Don't expect this thing to do lowercase well. But it does seem to do uppercase very well. So if you're interested in having a simple display, some alphanumeric characters, only four digits. It's not, they're nice big digits. They're very, very, very bright. Um, so um, yeah, I suppose you could put uh, multiple, since you can uh, jumper the uh, I squared C addresses, you could have them at different, different addresses and have uh, some of these in, uh, up stacked together. Anyway, so if you're interested in this thing, or you're, you were thought about buying one and wasn't quite sure, um, here it is. I don't think I'd buy another one. Um, uh, I think there are other better displays to be had out there, but it is interesting.